Hi, my name is Eric Felkel, and I'm the Optical Profilers Product Manager at Zygo Corporation. And I'm here to show you one of our new products that we've got at Photonics West, the NuView 9000. So it's the latest generation of coherent scanning interferometer in the NuView family. Uh, coherent scanning interferometry is a technology that lets us do non-contact 3D surface profiling of virtually any surface, whether it's rough or smooth, whether it's uh, flat or curved, whether it's got discontinuous surfaces or, uh, or it's just a, a continuous surface. Um, basically, it, it works by sending white light down into a microscope objective that has its own interferometer. And that interferometer uh, has a built-in reference surface, and we compare whatever surface we want to measure to that perfectly flat reference mirror inside the objective. By scanning that objective away from the part, we can profile different heights very, very quickly. Um, the NuView 9000 uh, brings to this technology uh, a very large sensor. Uh, we're going at 1.9 megapixels now, and it runs very, very quickly. Uh, it's typically only seconds to make a measurement. So in addition to being fast and uh, large area, uh, it's also bringing some ease of use features uh, to Cohen scanning interferometry. Basically making it so you can go from bringing a part up to the tool to having data in really just a matter of seconds. So this demonstration part that I have is a small semiconductor sample, and I'm going to show you how easy it is to go from setup through making a measurement. So first thing I do, I've got it underneath my system. It's just sitting under the objective. It's not in focus. Uh, and what I've done is I brought the, the, uh, the system to look underneath the part. I'm just going to press one button. It's a new button that we have in our software called Find Part. What this is going to do is automatically scan through and locate where the part is and optimize our light level. So that all we need to do is press that Find Part button and then start a measurement. Um, measurement's only going to take about five seconds, and we've basically gone from installing a part to having new data on the screen less than a minute. 